David Wells has described the slave mask terracottas from Lippery and tried to analyse what it is in their design that gives rise to particular expressions. So we'll see how some of his ideas work with my mask. One thing he finds is a scheming, prying, shifty look in the mask and argues that this effect is produced by the way the slave mask, even when its face is turned away from spectators, still appears to be watching them. So if I turn the mask to one side, we can see that one eye does appear to be looking forward, and same thing on the other side. And if following Miles's instructions, I tilt the mask downwards to the left, we can see the same thing. 